You're welcome back to Channel Sport this morning. Now, before we went on the break, we're talking about the uh, uh, unification bout between Anthony Joshua and uh, Joseph Parker. Um, the deal is very close now. Revenue split has been agreed, and the likely destinations are uh, London, Manchester, or Cardiff. So uh, they're still yet to decide on that one as well. So, and the date um, is going to be between uh, March uh, 31 and April 28th. That's when that bout is ex expected to go down. So as soon as we get uh, confirmation uh, of those uh, details, uh, we'll bring, bring him to you on Channel Sport this morning. Let's uh, move on uh, and talk about, uh, I mean, um, yeah, it's been in the news uh, for uh, how many days in a row now? Victor uh, Mutko, the head of um, Russia's uh, football Federation, uh, and uh, this one hasn't come to me as a surprise. At uh, all. Uh, you expected it. You actually said it on the previous show, uh, even though he hadn't stepped down by then. But uh, news coming out says um, he stepped down as the head of the organizing committee for the 2018 FIFA World Cup. Uh, this still, you know, stems uh, from his ban uh, mm -hmm. by the IOC, you know, because he's been implicated in that systematic doping mm -hmm. uh, scandal yeah, that has brought uh, Russia uh, for the last uh, few yeah. years now. FIFA is an affiliate of the IOC, mm. and um, it's, uh, it's a big stain, whether it's proven or not. And I guess a lot of people do, don't even want any proof at this stage anymore uh, because the allegations are just too, uh, too, da too damning. And um, uh, Vitaly Mutko did the honorable thing, mm. and whether or not it's FIFA, that's another conspiracy theory. If it is FIFA that... That they say, look, <laughs> we don't want you to have anything to do with 2018, so that we don't get stayed. And he, you know, maybe that's it. Because he stepped out from his role in the uh, football union for six months. Effectively, it's not going to have anything to do with the World Cup. And also, he has a he, he had a key role in organizing in the organizing of, of the World Cup. Right now, he has stepped out from that role as well. And uh, so FIFA, FIFA doesn't want any taints. FIFA doesn't want anything that paints them uh, in bad light. But while all of this is happening, uh, a little credit must go to uh, Mutko because he's trying to clear Absolutely. his name. Yeah. And he has stepped down from all of these roles, whether he has been pressured into doing it or, or whether he did the honorable thing by himself. Mm. Uh, I mean, I, I don't, we can't really say for now. Yeah. But the most important thing is he did all those things and he's trying to clear his name. Some people will say, if you have something, uh, in your, if you have so something, hide. In your, in your, you, you just probably hide. Right. But he's not hiding. Yeah. He's fighting, and he hopes to clear his name in yeah. time to resume. Uh, mm. uh, but but uh, in a court of public opinion, right. I think a lot of people already consider that Russia did something wrong. In yeah, a court I mean, of public opinion, yeah. you listen to people and what everybody is say. Mm. A lot of people think, uh, you know, if, if something is as high as the level of the state mm. organizing, uh, you know, and uh, multiple bodies, uh, WADA, the independent body, a lot Rus of them are saying these yeah. guys did this, and there's a whistleblower who's also Russian <laughs> yeah. coming out to say this is what is going on. Yeah. I guess a lot of people are not just... You know, they, they, they don't want to listen to any defense, mm. uh, any excuse, and, and it's understandable. Yeah, understandable, like you said, as well, to really serious uh, allegations. Uh, he has to clear his name, and that's just uh, uh, what, what he needs to focus on now before he can return to uh, administration yep. of uh, football. Still football administration, um, but this time... Um, the U.S. USA. I mean, I think they're still smarting. Uh, from not qualifying from the World Cup, and that's where all this has come from. Now mm -hmm. there's going to be a new uh, elections, and um, a, a former player uh, wants to get a job now because he believes it's high time. You know, someone. I, I don't like to use this um, yeah, phrase. Someone who's played the game uh, runs the administration, uh, runs football. Uh, anyway, I mean, we've seen mm -hmm. people that didn't play the game do a good job, yes, great uh, job. of uh, you know administering uh, the game. But um, that's what it seems to be saying. Yeah, Eric Ronaldo. Right. Um, a, a lot of hearts were thrown into the ring. Hope Solo has, at, at some point, too, <laughs> says she wants to be. Yeah. And like you said, all comes from uh, the fact that the U.S. They didn't qualify <laughs> for the World Cup. And a lot of people said the incumbents, uh, I mean, should go. He didn't do a good job. At some point, the incumbents. You know, I'm not going to contest uh, the election. I think he's had a change of mind, a change of heart yeah. uh, now. But when Aldo says, look, I can turn things around. I want to see major changes in, in U.S. football. And um, he feels he has a chance because of the circumstances um, surrounding uh, the Federation now. So let's go listen to Ronaldo and um, his views, his thoughts about the upcoming election 
into the United States Football Federation. Uh, who just want to see the, the sport continue to progress appropriately. Uh, I, I don't believe that that will be the case uh, under the current establishment. Um, and it's important, I think, in our country uh, to have uh, a federation with a little bit more soccer knowledge, a little bit more of a soccer IQ uh, at the top because we, we've, we've failed to uh, address the, uh, the product, if you will, and the product has now let us down. So there's a lot to do. There's a lot to do on the professional level, on the youth level. Uh, but our country needs to recognize this as a moment uh, to change things. All right. So um, I don't know if you agree. He says under this current administration, those changes that he's talking about, those mm. changes, uh, that's Eric Wanalda, those changes he's talking about, it's not going to happen. Mm. I mean, that's what, uh, that's what you're supposed to do when you're contesting for a position like that. You want to... Cast uh, doubt. Yeah, you want to say, okay, yeah, the previous guys that were there, they've not done a good job. And that's, that's why, why And that's why they've not qualified for the World Cup. And that's why I'm here. And I'm uh, supposed to... Yeah, we're bringing a new dawn. And that's, that's really what uh, football politics is about. And that's what Eric uh, is just trying to convince, um, you know, all the, all the guys, all the stakeholders that um, he's the right guy uh, for the position. And uh, we're very interested to see how this um, particular election... A lot, goes, feel, um, a lot of people feel he's an outsider. And we've yeah, seen he that. is an outsider. We've yeah. seen that in, in this part, too. We have yeah. people who are hugely popular with the fans. Mm. But when it comes to the football politics, it's a, it's a, a lightweight, paperweight. But yet, some of them seem not to be aware of that. Mm. You can be popular with the fans. Yeah, when it comes to football votes. politics, it's, it's, it's somewhere else. Mm -hmm. uh, but we'll keep watching and see what happens uh, in that one. Let's bring you to all that we're doing. Uh, we've talked about a, a whole lot of things on the show this morning. Uh, we've talked about Vincent Iyama. Uh, looks like it might be on his way to a new club. We'll keep you posted. We've also uh, talked about boxing. We're going to see uh, Parker and uh, Anthony Joshua uh, square off uh, on a later date when... Uh, the deal is signed, and we talked about Nadal, we talked about Djokovic, and we talked about the United States uh, Football Federation election. Talk to us about all of these issues and some things you also feel we should be talking about on the show. Send us a mail.